Happy New Year from Soap Lily. I'm Kathy. And I'm Allison. And we're back. Uh, and we're Why gonna, are you tapping? I don't know, because I'm... You're directing. I'm, well, I'm nervous. Um, <laughs> today, we decided to try something that we invented. <laughs> this, is, this is like... You know, we aren't sure what how this invention's going to go. But this is kind of like what we were drawing. We had all kinds of sketches and colors and... This is the one that looks the clearest. So we are going to use this one and it's gonna be concentric circles. We're gonna st start with peach and then keep pouring in our 18 bar mold. We'll do peach, orange, white, orange, white, white, pink, white, and then leave it the middle with pink. And then we're gonna do all this weird stuff, we hope, with a skewer because we like to skewer. So that's what we're doing in our, <laughs> our, our, excuse me, our color combination, not our color combination, yeah, our color combination is basically going to be, we used uh, Brambleberries Fired Up Fuchsia, Brambleberries Tangerine Wow, Brambleberries Titanium Dioxide, and then we use Crafter's Choice uh, Ivory Lace Sparkle Mica Powder, and then we also, for just for kicks and giggles, we added some um, nurture pink vibrance and orange vibrance in the pinks and the oranges. So we we coming up with a peach color, which is kind of a combination of these two, and then orange and pink, and then white. And the, the, I should have recorded you mixing the colors when you go into mad scientist mode. I know, I know, but anyway. And the, what we 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 are mad scientists today because we are using. Two Nature's Garden and one from Camden Gray. This is our orange essential oil, five, five, uh, five fold. Five fold, yeah. And then we are mixing it with jasmine and sweet patchouli, and we did it equal amounts. So and it smells great. It really does. And this is <clears throat> what it looks like. So we know that that is going to color our soap a little orange. Right. So everything will have sort of an orange, orange exactly. or tint to it. Yes. you think I've tried to give up thinking pulse it two more times or not well I would not but you and I think differently sometimes I know I just don't want it to be I'll do it on low I'm just trying to see if there's any streaks still I don't think there are. There was. There, I wish there was some magic. You're emulsified. <laughs> you know, that would tell us. But there's not. Like a meat thermometer. Yeah, exactly. For emulsification. Emulsification thermometer. All right. So now I have to stop saying so now. Yes. And I need to put the majority of. No. No, not the majority. Oh no. No. Yes. All right, fingers are crossed. What you think, Al? Um, go for it. I say go for it. Okay. So I'm start with peach. Peach. Um, is that peach? This is peach. This is peach. This orange. is orange. Okay. And that it looks very pink. 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 Well, hopefully it's not going to. So we need a whole bunch of this. That's. And then I need to get a whole bunch of. Spurchulers. Because this is going to be. It's a pretty color. It is a pretty color. It's pretty loose. Yep. I hope that the colors don't bleed. Yeah, that's what I'm concerned about now. That if if maybe we need to go ahead and mix this a little bit more to get it just a smidge more, because that's really that is very watery. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Okay. I 
think you need just a little bit more in that bowl. This in here? Yes. All right. I'm just looking at the bottom of the, mm -hmm. um, the mold. Yeah. Yay? More? A little bit, yeah. Okay. All right, and then I'm going to come over here and put this back here for just a second, and I am going to mix this up just a little more. Okay, if you've ever done a column pour or a funnel pour, this is kind of like that, except we're freehand pouring. <laughs> this is kind of like a what? A Kathy Allison special? No, it's kind of like, um, I don't know what it's like. It's Well, I mean, a column pour is where you have the block in the middle and you pour right. over it. So whoa, 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 whoa. What? Bring that up here to me for a second. The whole thing. This. Oh, is it one of my hair? Mm -hmm. Okay. So what we're doing first is we're putting the peach in. Right. And right, I'm hoping right you're right in the middle. In the center. That is a pretty color. Yeah, and we're going all the way, I hope to heaven, it goes all the way out to the outside edges. We're just tapping a little. Which is what we want it to. Well, the next color will push it out. Yeah, it will. Oh, what, are you got my director's notes up there. What's yes, the next, next one? Yes, next you want orange. Orange. Okay, now the problem I've got here is this. <laughs> no room. I know. Let me put this. Like. Oh dear, we need to enlarge our studio. <laughs> Dump some of this in here. Yay. Mm, a little more. Yay. Mm, maybe. Okay. And we're going to put it in. Wait, wait, you might need to add some more because you were going to save some to add the white to to make your orange white. Oh, you're right. Huh. Thank you. That's why you're up there directing. And I'm not. Because that's what I do. Okay. More. Because okay. you're doing two colors. That's true. All right. So we added a little bit more orange because it just wasn't right, quite orange. Hopefully, enough. I'm dead center right in the center. middle. Yeah. Oh, it's not going the way I wanted it to. Well, you can uh, make it. Pooey. It screwed it up. Well, that's all right. Okay. Mm mm. Tap the. God damn no, it! Didn't do no, it. I didn't do it, did it? Mm -mm. So, <laughs> so much for that one. That's all right. And save some white. Yeah, I'm gonna all plan. Of it. put some white in here. This is our orange white. Maybe the pink, the peach got too hard. You think? Uh, I think the pink did sit in there. That's what I meant, the peach. Oh, yeah, peach, sorry. All right, and here's this. It should be whiter. Oh, this may not. <laughs> so much fun. Add a, well, add a little bit more soap to it. Soap? Yeah, is that going to be enough? Yeah, okay. it's plenty. I mean, I'm okay. I guess I need to get down here really close, don't I? Yeah. Or way up high or not? So, the best laid plans don't always lay very well, pretty much. But it's okay. Yeah. It'll be pretty, sort of. No, it will be. Well, once we swirl it, it'll be pretty. But the idea was to have concentric circles and all of the circles show. The, all the circles are showing. I think we put maybe used too much of the orange. You think? Yeah. Well, all right. Now the next thing I'm right, doing is the next what? color is white. Okay, so I'm gonna pour white in here. This in here.
was to, the idea, the original idea was to come in and go like swirl, 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 sort of like here, and then come out and do it here. Do it anyway. All right, so starting here mm -hmm. and going. Mm -hmm. Heaven only knows what this is going to look it's like. It's going to be me. gorgeous. I'm telling you. Yeah, I'm sure. I have to say it's very loose. Yeah. All right, and then I come in and I go, I went this way, so this is going to come in like... Because I'm going all the way to the bottom with mm -hmm. my squiggles or whatever you call them. Yep. And then this one goes like that, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, that's not really... Okay, then we were going to go like this, right? Well, you were going to start at the... Like... Hang on, let me get back to our original plan. Start at the like center and go out to each corner. Like here, 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 and here. Uh -huh. But you okay. might want to use something bigger than the skewer. Okay. Um, All right, let's see what I've got. So I'm going to go start in the middle uh -huh. and go out to the over corner. like this. Yep. It's getting hard. And then out to the corner. The, the corners are getting... I should wipe it off with, between each one, but I'm yeah. not. Because at this point, I mean, seriously. All right, then go to um, each Here. side and uh -huh. start at the outside and drag it in. Okay. Here. Mm -hmm. Here. Mm -hmm. Here. Mm -hmm. I should wipe this off. Well, don't now. You've already... Well, I know. And here. Yeah. Okay, then what? Then you need to clean up the middle. So just take that, stick it down in there, and go whoosh, whoosh. Like, yeah. Or maybe I'll do this. Make it look swirly, sort of. Swirly and whirly. But I got to do more out here, though, don't I? Yeah. You don't have to. Yeah, but I mean, I think the idea was to do something over here. Something else. Um. It was to go back and forth like this. Like this. No, you were going to do, depending on how it looked when you got done, mm -hmm. you were going to go back in between each radiant. Here? Uh-huh. And do this. Oh, the squirrel. I think I'm going to do that. Yeah. So squirrely, 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 squirrely. Like that. Mm -hmm. And squirrely, 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 squirrely. Pretty. It is pretty. I'm glad we put that darker. Is that it? Mm. Did I do this one already? I think I already did. Do one. Where? Never mind. That was it. Didn't I get them all? Yeah, you did. This is where I can't stop. I'm stopping. Don't drop yeah. them. Oh, did I jinx you? Yeah, you did. It's your fault. Sorry. Yes. Yahoo! That's really pretty. Cat. So we don't know what this is, do we? No. It's. We'll come up with a name for yeah, it. Yeah, it's, it's something. Yeah, it, it's, uh, it looks pretty. It smells terrific. Oh, the smell is fabulous. And um, the only thing we did, which was weird because we um, used our Brambleberry 18 bar mold and we have the handy dandy lid that came, that came with it and we put it on top. It didn't fit down in there because the um, liner sticks up, but um, it, was, it was sealed 
So we're thinking. And we oh. sprayed it. We sprayed it and we're thinking, yay, no ash. But we opened it up and ash. ash. So Which you can is, hear the kettle boiling behind yes. us. So anyhow, here goes the unveiling. Ooh, Ooh I like the bottom. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. All this out of here, and and it's actually been two days. Oh yeah, it has. That's very true. Okay. Oh dear. Why did you say oh dear? Because my phone just dinged and it's. Oh. Uh. <laughs> it's always the. Why way. do you seem conflicted? Because I, I am conflicted. Because I never can figure out how to. I just got it all over my sweater. But how to get this out of here without mushing it. Mushing it. Wait, hold it up. I am. I'm just trying to get the extra little pieces off. Uh -huh. I think we're going to have to get ourselves a little plainer thing. Yeah. It's pretty. That is pretty. So Kathy has all the soaps out of the mold now. And you can see, gosh, they smell so good, Kathy. I know. You can see the ash that's on the top. Mm -hmm. So Kathy is... Steaming. So, yep. This is how it looks after well, she. Here, here's why I'm getting ready to do this. And I'll one. show you the process of her. I'm trying to move slowly so I don't make give. it throw up. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right. <coughs> so here's ash all okay. over it. And then just come in here and. Sometimes it bubbles a whole lot. This is not bubbling for some reason. I don't know why it's going away. Mm -hmm. a, a word of caution. This is like really hot. <laughs> you speak with experience. Yes. And that's what it looks like de ashed. Much and better. it will dry. Yeah, it'll it's dry. dry now yeah. it's wet. It's, I, you don't want to touch it for a few minutes. So. Yeah.